My name is Danny Clark. I'm a garden designer and a self-confessed friend of the earth. And I'm going to show you how to plant a tree. And it's a lot easier than you might think. What you will need is a spade. You will need some compost and a tree. The tree I'm planting today is Plum Victoria. It's one of Britain's favorite fruit trees and it produces oodles of fruit. So the first thing we need to do is to position the tree. Every tree or shrub has a face. It has its better side, a bit like us humans. So I want to show off the side that's going to be most attractive to the way you're viewing the tree. Now that I've got the tree in position, I just need to dig the hole. So just mark where you want the hole to be. So I'm just twisting the pot around and I can see the indentation in the soil. And I know this is where I need to dig. It's as simple as that. Now, <laughs> I've got a little trick up my sleeve because this ground is very hard and it's proven quite difficult to get through. So what I'm going to do is put some water in the hole and let it soak through. And while I'm doing that, I'm going to have a cup of tea. So already that's a lot easier. The water has definitely softened the soil. And we all like to make our lives easier when we can, don't we? Now, it's a good idea just to do a little test before I dig any further, just to make sure the hole is the size that I want it to be. So I'm just going to remove the tree from its temporary home, which is that pot, and just put it in the hole just to gauge if I've dug the hole to my liking. And although the hole looks deeper than it should be, I'm very happy with that because I can backfill and get the tree up to the correct height. Now I've dug the hole larger than it needs to be and I just need to check my levels. So I know that this is too deep for this tree, so I need to build it up again so I'll use this mixture that I've already created and just pull it in the bottom of the hole, like this. I'll just do another scoop. I reckon that might do it. Just to level it up a bit. And I think, yes, I'm happy with that. And now all I need to do is backfill. And there we go. Plant it with love, that's what I say. Now, one of the most important things you can do to any tree that you're planting is to make sure it's well watered, especially within the first few years of its life. Once it's set, it will just find its own way. And finally, I'm just going to add this bark mulch, which will lock the moisture in and slow down evaporation. And the other bonus, it will keep the base of the tree free of weeds. Now, Here's a tree that's at ease with its surroundings because it's native to this country and the wildlife are going to love it. Now, this is one beautifully planted Plum Victoria. <laughs>